guess what? I memorized my ABCs. Do you want to hear? Sure. Okay, uh, wait. Can, can you just remind me of the first letter? Um, A? Uh, that's right, that's right, yeah. The first letter of the ABCs is A. Uh, then, uh, what's the second letter again? B. Yes, yes, A, B. C. I was getting there. It's A, B, C. I did it. I recited my ABCs. What about the rest of the letters? There's more to the ABCs than just A, B, C. <laughs> it's Coco Talk. Today's guests brighten the bread with a message about the Lord's Prayer. And our friend Fruitcake with friendly talking tips. Now our hosts, Coco and Marsha. Welcome everyone. Today, Brighten the Bread is here to share about the Lord's Prayer. Which one? The Lord's Prayer. Uh, the Lord Jesus prayed a lot. Yes, but there was one prayer he prayed to teach the disciples how to pray. It goes like this. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. What does hallowed mean? It means honor, like to show respect. Oh, so we start by honoring God's name. Exactly. Then it goes, your kingdom come, your will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Wait, like a castle kind of kingdom? No, it's saying we know that God is the ruler of all, even on earth. He has power over everything, and because he is good and loving, we can trust him. Yeah, I love that he hears us when we pray. He hears us and he answers what is best for us. Then we pray, give us this day our daily bread. Like Brighton. Yep, this reminds us that God provides exactly what we need each day. After that, we ask and forgive our debts as we forgive our debtors. Debt or what? Is this part of the prayer about money? No, debtor. It's about forgiveness. Jesus is the best example of forgiving people. He sure is. The rest of the prayer is, do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Ooh, the evil one? That sounds scary. We don't have to be scared because God is watching over us. <sighs> that is good. Oh, I just remembered that I made something to remind me of the Lord's Prayer. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive our debts as we forgive our debtors. And do not lead us into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. For yours is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Wow. Did you add that last part in? I'm not familiar with that ending. Coco, I can't believe you don't know this prayer. I do know it. We just went over... Never mind. Let's ask Brighton about... Is it really time to wrap up already? Thanks for being here, Brighton, and Fruitcake. We so wanted to hear your tips on talking, or really just to hear you talk in general. I bet you have a beautiful voice. Talk to you all next time on Coco Talk. <laughs>